exploded today. From her home in Pequot Lake, Stacy Earholtz described tonight what it's like to be part of medical history. I think it already is huge. It's huge in the making. For 10 years, Earholtz has battled multiple myeloma and incurable blood cancer. She was out of options last summer when the Mayo Clinic chose her for an experimental procedure where they injected her with a large amount of the measles virus. Afterwards, I found out it was enough vaccination to inoculate 10 million people. Despite that, she describes the treatment the easiest she's ever had, lasting only about 40 minutes. The only side effects were a very painful headache and fever. Both disappeared fairly quickly, she says. And as it turns out, so did her cancer. I had a plasma cytoma right here on my forehead, the size of a golf ball. And within 36 hours, it was gone. A tumor so the size of a golf ball gone. I was really excited. This is Stephen Russell. Her doctor, Stephen Russell, says for years researchers have known that viruses could kill cancers, at least in animals, but never in humans. Until now. Viruses can work as a vaccine and if you inject a virus into a tumor you can provoke the immune system to then come and destroy that cancer and other cancers. And while it still needs to be replicated, what's happening here is providing the one thing everyone battling cancer so desperately needs. Hope. It's the way of the future and I'm, I'm so excited for other people to experience this.